make some money. Well, let's see if we get this locker here. It's a little five by five. I bid forty dollars on it, and I'll be going down to get this. It looks like. Boom! I got it. I got the locker. Uh, storage options. It's funny. I've kind of done things in reverse in my life. You know, you know, you hear about people doing storage auctions, buying storage units for years and years, and they say, some, they say, they hope to hit a big lick so they can retire. Okay? Here's the thing with me. I'm retired, and then I decided to start buying storage units because I enjoy it. So I kind of am backwards there. All right, guys. I bought a little five by five out here at Prime Storage. Every now and then, I like to buy one of these dine and dashers because you just never know what you're going to find. I only paid forty dollars, so when you look on the surface, maybe you don't see forty dollars. But let's see what we can find. Uh, what is that? Well, we're off to a blazing start. We got a lid to. <laughs> A lid to a cooler. All right, not a good start. What we got here? Oh boy! Oh. These are um, yeah. These are really big. They're not going to fit me. There's some pants in here. I can't see any guys. <laughs> Goose egg. First bag. Goose egg. Alright, what we got here? Dave Ramsey's Financial Peace University. Oh Lord. Well, I can sell that up here at half price books. They'll probably give me a dollar for it, so we're up to one. What do you think, guys? Up to a dollar already? John Ford, Nathan Hospital Capitals. Let's see what else we got going over here. I guess you're probably thinking I blew 40 bucks. Maybe I did. Nothing. What else we got here? What? Four dollar receipt. The suit. Uh, okay. Nothing. What do we got going here? New suits. What do we got here? That looks like ladies. Ladies clothes there. Uh, some kind of Chinese. It's not in very good shape. So I'm, I'm guessing we've got some geese here, guys. To me, this looks like a flock of geese. It's okay, we can handle some geese. We're not done yet. Now, this big book right here, oh God, it was two dollars in half price books. They're not gonna give me anything for this. Probably 10 cents if, if that. Well, that can go with that. So, we're up to a dollar 10. What do you think, is this the best unit you've ever seen for 40 bucks? I noticed this had the tag on it. Players Incorporated. Terrell Owens jersey. 81. If somebody was doing eBay, they might be able to get... They might bring like 20 bucks. I don't know what I could get for it, but we'll see if I... I might be able to get something. So I won't call that a good thing. Oh, God. 
I, you know what? Never in We got to do here, guys. Oh. Curious George. And the firefighters. Curious George is a crazy little monkey. All right, there it is. Half price books. 20 cents. I'm sure our resident Curious George will get a kick out of that one. All right, Dave Ramsey, Total Money Makeover book. Yeah. 10 more cents, guys. We're up to what, up 30? box cutter. What do you think guys? I'm going to call that a goose egg. We're going to have some geese in this one. There we go. Oh boy, what do we got here? Well, the little scuff. I think these are going to be like little figurines. You know what, I've seen enough already to know goose egg. Yeah, it's a goose egg, guys. Let's keep going. While we're having fun. <laughs> oh, what is that? Nothing. Oh, we got a flashlight that works. I'm going to say that's something. Uh, a quarter? Okay. We're, we're pushing two dollars here, guys. That is awesome. Now, moving on to the next. Let's see what else we got here. It just takes one. 1776 to 1976. Uh, you know what that's worth? Nothing! Presley's Island Adventure. Uh, maybe Half Price Books, Dick and Jane. Wait a minute, this is P This is supposed to be a PG show, guys. I didn't hear they're putting out this stuff. Oh, never mind. <laughs> My bad. All right, 20 cents half price book. I'd say we're running around two dollars. Okay. Fancy whole smoked mussels. Yeah. One thing they won't get in this unit is a smoked mussel. That's for damn sure. Oh boy. Oh, a little salt and shaker. Uh, Looking like a pumpkin. Uh, yeah. Baking soda. Maybe that's salvageable. Maybe. Fly ribbon. Oh boy. We better find something pretty quick. This unit's going to hell in a handbasket, guys. Uh, I thought I'd take a chance because it was cheap. Well, all I've done is, apparently I've added to our garbage. There's a lot of geese here. All right, let's throw this.
starting lineup, Legends, Joe Namath and Johnny Unitas. I'm willing to say that's probably two bucks, maybe five. So we'll put that in the possibilities. I'll call it five just to be optimistic here. That, so we're up to seven bucks. Uh, oh, this is full of that stuff. Oh, okay, this is good. Oh, shit. Joe Montana Drive. Yeah, that doesn't fly real well with me because back when my Bengals, back in the day, they knocked my Bengals out of both the Super Bowls they were in. Well, we got a lot of collectibles down here, guys. Baseball cards. Let's see what year these are. Uh, Larry Walker Expos. That doesn't seem too old. 90s, early 90s. Yeah, Kirk McLean. Go. Oh, that's. Oh shit. All right. Well, we've got some things I got at least look up. This is all full of collectibles. Yeah. Uh... Oh. Oh, gold. Holy crap. Oh, guys, that's a lot of gold right there. We just struck gold in a $40 locker, guys. Ten carat. That is ten carat. Look at that, guys. We just scored. Bingo! Yeah, we're making money, guys. We're making money, guys. And we've got collectibles. Oh my god, yes. We got the wrestling awards. Oh, wow. That was a killer item, guys. I'm really excited about that. I took a $40 bill and turned it into a, probably, I'm guessing that's going to be over $100. Oh, look at all this. Oh, wow. This is all collectible stuff, guys. It goes in there. This is going to be a good one here. Oh, there's a box in here. $40. We got the Sports le uh, Legends, Joe Namath, Johnny Unitas. Here's, uh, who's this? Dick Butkus. Okay. All these are sports cards. Let's see what year we got here. Uh, Adobe McDowell, I don't know. Maybe you guys do, but maybe I got little bit of value here. I can usually sell these on Facebook. Here's another one. More cards. Kirk McLean. I don't think these are going to have much value because I don't think they're old enough. The Rockies. Yeah, these are going to be in the 90s. So they're not really old enough to have a lot of value, but they might have some. Here's another whole thing of cards. MVP card for uh, Dan Marino. Okay, we might have something here. 
I'll have to go through it closer, but there's a lot of Dan Marino stuff here. Okay, these are racing cards. So it looks to be a, a whole collection that I got here. Some yearbooks. Lots of clothes. And we looked at... Oh, who's this? Steve Young and Jerry Rice. Apparently he was a 49er fan because there's Joe Mount Montana Drive. Uh, Alright, that's got the guy's name on it. You can't see it. Brand new pack of 1990 collector set NFL football. These brand new, still sealed. That's probably some money. And we got uh, 1998 Barry Sanders sports figure. We've got uh, who's this guy? He looks familiar. Um, where's his name? Steve Young. It's right in front of my face. That's why I couldn't see it. I can't pull all these out. It's going to be so heavy, but if you'll notice down here, all the cards that are in this box, I can't pull all those out, but there are a lot of them. Uh, sports awards, Kentucky High School Athletic Association, more cards. We'll have to check these for value, but uh, William Floyd, he's got a lot of 40, 49er memorabilia. Bruce Bosley. So, yeah, he was the center there. So, and here's another whole box just full of cards. Wow. I'm going to have to go through all this stuff. But uh, this was a really good score for a $40 unit. And guys, this isn't even the best. This isn't even the best. $40 Dining Dasher. Um, before I get to the better item, I can put that all up when we're done with the video. We got a cooler. This dresser was from the locker I got yesterday, and there's another, like a microwave card. But there's a lot of clothes, and it uh, will come over here. We've got the, there's, there are uh, suits. I've never been able to sell suits, but we have them all blondered and everything on a hanger. We got some figurines in there, books. We got a jewelry box. I didn't find any jewelry in there, but uh, we're going to look a little bit closer. A whole thing of kids' books. This is money up at the bookstore. But uh, what else we got here? All kind of stuffed animals, but that's from yesterday. It didn't come in today. Uh, I, I have to show you the cream of the crop here. All right. This was also in that uh, thing of sports memorabilia. A Lunker 10 karat gold class ring. That's probably going to be, I'm going to be guessing right out, uh, right, uh, I'm thinking it would be about $160. That's in a $40 locker, guys. That's why I buy storage units right there. Let's see if it'll pick up the 14K. Can you focus in and see if it gets that? Are you seeing it? Kind of. I don't know if it's picking it up, guys, but uh, that's a 14 karat gold ring. Wow. So, anyway, if you like this video today, uh, no, if, if <laughs> please like this video today and please subscribe and share the video. And uh, this Saturday, I'm really, really trying to get in on a a really good locker. I don't want to say where because you know how it is. We've got other people that could watch it that may be bidding. But anyway, I will see you very soon and uh, thank you for watching.